Hi, my name's Mitz and I'm signed into my WordPress website dashboard and I just want to show you how to create categories for your website. Now I can show you what categories are. I'll go to another website here. If I press on this it'll show me the website and I can show you what categories are. Okay, so this is obviously it's fillyourmoneybox.com now down the side here it has categories of where the posts go into so that's that's how you sort your posts out so this this website's about saving money and stuff like that or making money so it's got all these um, categories that are related to it making money ideas kids saving money organizing your life save money at Christmas save on car expenses stuff like that okay so it's all got to do with saving money and stuff like that now that's what categories are so what it's done is split up all the posts into categories so I can just click on something and say oh yeah this one interests me so I'll click on that and it will take me to the category okay avoid food waste and it'll give me all the articles to do with that subject all right now I'll go back to the other dashboard of the other website now I'm going to show you how to create a category so what we're going to do is we're going to go to posts we click on that and then we go to categories Now, here are the categories that I've already made. Now, this is a WordPress website builder website. Okay, so what it's going to do is show you how to build a WordPress website. So, I put categories in relating to that. Adding AdSense to your WordPress. Adding affiliate banners to your WordPress. Building a WordPress website. How to build a WordPress website how to build WordPress categories etc etc okay now what I did is I just came over here and I put the name in here so just say um, what other category can I have I'll just say WordPress um, comments okay and what this is, it, it says it down here, it can make it URL friendly. Now if I had a lot of words here or weird letters or something like that, I can change it and make it shorter here. But um, that's only two words, so it's going to be fine. It's just going to have a dash in between there, so I don't need to add anything in there. Okay. Um, if this is a parent category that means a top level one it explains it down here as well so you or you can go you can be a subcategory of something now this one's just going to be a parent category and then we put a description in here okay so we're doing WordPress comments so we'll just put we're going to um, give a description of what this category is. So this category is going to how to organize comments on your WordPress website. How to approve or delete comments after they have been posted. Anyway, etc. etc. Now, the name of the game is to use some keywords so the keywords would be comments and WordPress so there, there they are up there 
Now I'm going to press Add Category, right, and it just added it over here. Okay, so it doesn't matter what order it's in or anything like that, that's fine. Now as you can see I haven't got any posts in any of these yet, this is just a new website. Okay, so there's the categories. Now the categories do not show up on the web page until you put a post in them. Alright, um, the other way to make a category is when you're making a post. Now I've got a couple of posts, so I'll go into the posts section here. And when you press on that, the posts come up. So I'm just going to press here because I want to edit this post. As you can see, it's a draft. Right. Is WordPress a website or a blog? Now that is um, one of my posts. I haven't actually written anything yet, but I will. Um, now if I wanted to put that into a particular category, I'd come over to the category section here on the right and press on add new category and then I type in what category I wanted. Now if I make a category here right it's not going to have the description and everything in it so you just got to remember that. Um, so I would prefer to go and do it properly like I just showed you. So basically all yeah if you do want to do it this way right wordpress um, tips and then press add and it comes up and also ticks it so that means that this post is going to be in that category now that's how easy it is to add a category but like I said it doesn't um, include having a description and all that important stuff for search engine optimization alright thanks for watching